Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. We are here finally to check out the first episode of To Your Eternity from the creator of A Silent Voice. This is definitely another one of my most anticipated series for this season. I actually talked about this in the trailer reaction I did for this series, but I have read like the first three or four chapters of the manga. So it's not really a lot. Like I'm mostly blind uh, when it comes to this series. And I read these chapters, like I'm talking like 2016 when the series like first started i read like the first three or four chapters and, and what i remember the most i'm not gonna go into detail so i'm not gonna spoil anything like that i just remember like it was instant depression so if that's how i felt reading like with the voice acting and with the animation all that it, it might even make me feel more because it, it's been a while it's been a while since I've read, um, but I I'm really excited to get into this series and see what it what it's you know gonna have to offer beyond what I read, which is like three or four chapters. So yeah, without further ado, let's hop into this first episode, everyone. Here we go. It was an orb. See, I got I don't even really honestly remember this. I just remember it just there's just being depression. Cast the orb into Earth and observe it. Kenjiro Suda, by the way, you guys probably already knew that. So the orb spent time as a rock. Oh, got a. You see that cut? See that cut on the leg? Yo, it's trudging through the snow. Survival of the fittest, man. Survival of the fittest. Oh, on the rock. On the rock. That same rock. And it took the form of the wolf. See, this, this whole concept is so sweet to me. Like, have you saw something like kind of like this? There probably is something out there, but it's first discomfort. Yo, this narration from from Kenjiro Suda too. Oh man, imagine that, right? Your first like uh, moment of life is out here in this snow like this. You got that wound as well. There's so much shit. Two whole months. But it's not the same wolf. If it could speak, it would have said it wanted to stay here forever. Damn. The first person it met. And it was just treating him like it was like his own. Because really it was like the, the look. But obviously he doesn't know about the whole orb shit. I just love that shot. this shot right here. I don't know what it is about it. Just them side by side. So they're like, they're like wandering out to find uh, essentially like a better place. I tried to go with the grown-ups, but I couldn't because you stopped me. <laughs> he don't remember that. I guess it's not, we don't know what the gender is. So I guess it for the, for the wolf. I was just thinking about that. I've been saying he. What kind of contraption is this? Ah, oh, man. Is this like probably the wind or something? Ugh. There's a fish on it. Okay. <laughs> right, that part's usually your favorite. He has to start noticing that something's up here, something's different with the uh, with the with the wolf, right? Okay, <laughs> munch munch. <laughs> what? You just talk? Oh, he didn't even have a reaction to it. Unless I was just kind of like a mental in in its head. See, these are, these are all the people that were here at one point. That that ambition. Ah, look at that, man. Paradise Island? What? <laughs> no. You don't want to go there. <laughs> Checkpoint or some kind of a marker, maybe? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> and I'm hungry. Another marker? <laughs> He's just so happy with like each marker, each each thing that they come across. Like we're getting closer, we're getting closer. Oh man, his fingers. That didn't look too good. Be careful now. Uh, that definitely was a whimper. Oh. Jeez. I mean, it already looked like your face was freezing. Your fingers too. I mean, maybe you're moving too quick. Take take more time to kind of rest and warm up. But... Oh, damn, I didn't even notice that. He didn't either. 
I'm not going back after we came this far. But is it like they're really, like he's really in a rush? If you gotta take a couple days to warm up, I mean, maybe the conditions are just, you know, certain circumstances can make it to where they have to keep going. Like, actually have to, but really pushing, pushing yourself to the, to the limit. Hey, like, hypo, like, I'm starting to work, get worried. Like, hypothermia, whatever, frostbite, all these other, and even the injury itself. This is his ambition, though. So I kind of get, like, can't rest too long or stay in one spot for too long. Got to keep going, but, I mean, man. Is that, like, blood? Is that blood on the marker? Oh, it's crossed out. What the hell? And they got, oh, just like they, he had it at, back at his place. There's a flag there, too. Man, he, he can barely walk. He's just trying to keep his spirits up, I think, and keep, and keep the wolf spirits up, too. Ah, oh, your face shows another thing than what your, your words, ah. Oh. The previous wolf, like, had to have, even though can't talk, was probably feeling or understanding some of the things you've been saying. Yeah, even this, even though it's like the or through the orb or whatever, it's like a whole new type of understanding. Treading back to home after they've came this far. Nah, man. They, they actually made it back. He uh, made it back in this shape. Can't even walk. Can't even... No more food. No more... No more anything, it looks like. He just keeps trying so damn hard. It's just so sad to see, too. This is probably like the last bit of food they have, it looked like. Crazy, dude. Stop. Like, stop. It's just so... It's kind of hard to watch, to be honest. It's just, it's just straight depressing because he keeps trying so hard, you know? They probably because he doesn't want to show weakness to the wolf, either. Like, I gotta keep going for, for, you know. Remember me. Jeez. In the chair with all the faces, and, and especially him and the wolf circle down there, like, in this spot. Oh. Yo, the way they animate that, the, like, the transformation shit is so cool. Going to carry on through him like this. Man. That's what he wanted. And the, the, you know, the wolf or the orb or whatever you want to say, taking all of this. Yes, taking on the form of this human and using that progressing forward with that in mind kind of what the boy wanted but even though it didn't the boy didn't know what this thing was still treated it as if yeah man oh yeah i remember for the for the pv dude it, this song sounds too good it's hikaru though so to to be expected Ooh. so here you know here's the thing I, I figured, okay, with the... Now, th obviously, maybe to you anime only, like, obviously, to to you anime only people, this might have came as, like, kind of like a surprise, right? Although, you could see as he was going along, it, it was just kind of like a chain effect, right? It, it was getting worse and worse and worse, his condition was. Um, But for me, like, that was the one thing, besides, I, besides remembering that it was depressing as hell off the start, the one main thing I did remember was this, like, the death of the boy... And, you know, it's setting in motion, essentially, the, you know, this wolf, which is, uh, at first was an orb, it was, a, you know, tur it became a rock, and then the moss on the rock, and then just so happened, right, this wolf dies, falls onto that same exact rock, right, and then takes form like that, and now, you know, the cycle continues, essentially, and, and so it can take the form of many different things, and we're probably going to see that as we go along with the series, he's not just going to be, uh, it's not, it's not going to be just in the form of the boy. So, uh, but yeah, the, the the way they set it off though into motion with this little story with the with the boy and the in you know the, I don't even know if you should refer to it as the wolf or the orb or whatever you want to say, but like what they did here, it, it was beautiful, and, it, and I feel like it even 
it, it still hits, but I already kind of knew like from from the manga or whatever, like when I read the first couple of chapters or whatever. So, but for y'all anime only people who maybe are jumping into this for the first time, it probably hit because I remember how much it hit me when I first read it. It hit me like a like a stack of bricks when when this shit was happening. It was just so hard to read. It was hard to just you know see the condition that he kept you know it just kept getting worse and worse and he was still trying to push himself and still trying to you know give it his all and i i think a big part in that was because he had this partner by him because i i think if he doesn't have this partner by him and it's just him by himself he doesn't even la you know last that long um so yeah not wanting to kind of show weakness or show that you know to show your partner like you know this wolf that okay everything's fine with me and even though the boy didn't know that this wolf wasn't the same wolf that he had before, still treated it like it was his own, like it you know, like it was nothing essentially, just like it was normal uh, to them. Uh, it was missing for two months though. That's that's uh, that's crazy. Pets and just animals in general are you know they can be humans, um, you know, best friend honestly, and and there could be even deeper connections there with your with your pets or animals than you know, you're like human members of your family. It's, it's crazy, man. It's, it's a beautiful thing though, too. But even besides that, like the whole, um, or like the whole message or the whole like thing with this boy's ambition and him wanting to get out there, meet all kinds of different people, see all kinds of different things. And now this wolf, you know, taking his form, essentially taking this new form as him and carrying on that, uh, is, is very special so it, it's very like this is just, like I remember when I first read it I was saying I haven't really there, there's not many things I can really compare this to and I'm still even saying that for sure especially if it's from this this orbs perspective or like how it's from this certain perspective it's it's very uh intriguing excuse me uh to me so yeah I I'm not gonna be like besides this I don't even remember because I, I read, like I said, the first, I think it was the first volume. It was literally, I think maybe the first volume, maybe not even that. It was a few chapters. Um, but the main thing I remembered with that was instant depression and that, and then like the thing with the boy dying and then the wolf taking uh, its, you know, his form. So besides that, I really don't remember anything. So I would say after here, after this episode, it's like, I'm, I'm completely blind. <laughs> so yeah, really, really good start though. I, I loved like the, the general like direction the animation, especially for the like transformations, right? Is just like very, very detailed, very crisp. Uh, reminds me, it's um of like some old style, like Studio Ghibli like esque animation, sort of like with that. So, in, in terms of the production value and the music and just a lot of those things, uh, really, really good for you know for the series so far i hope it can keep up as we go along through the series because i think it's been confirmed for uh 20 episodes i want to say kind of an odd episode count you usually don't get those but I, I believe it was confirmed for 20 episodes so uh yeah first episode of two year eternity you know it, it got me a little bit in the feels again although i kind of already knew what to expect i like for you anime only people i could i could only imagine right because i i just go back to when i first read this series for the first time and i was like it hit me like a, like i said a stack of bricks so i i know what y'all are feeling right now if you're feeling a certain type of way so yeah let me know what you all thought of this first episode of two year eternity if you guys did enjoy my reaction to this one make sure you drop a like subscribe if you're new and i'll see you all in the next one thank you for watching peace out